Jonas Seberg again, CPO with Real Life Prosthetics. So we have a uh, patient in this morning and he uh, uses an alloplastic finger uh, for restoring uh, biomechanical function, uh, being able to um, code. So he does a lot of keyboarding, a lot of data entry. So it's very important that with his prosthetic finger um, that we restore full length. So that way he has good opposition between thumb and pinky for grasping objects, for using utensils, and 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 the, the big thing for work is is for his keyboarding as he's coding. So <clears throat> he's in for a routine six month follow up. And the reason why we have patients in for six month follow ups is to make sure that their devices are fitting properly, functioning well, that there's no skin irritation um, as far as like fit, um, that fingers maintain full uh, vacuum suspension. And then, I, and then I take the prosthesis back into the lab and I take a fine, close look at it just to make sure that there's no separation of silicone, uh, the layers of silicone between the external layer, which is like a clear skin, and then the underlying skin tones, which is, um, which is a different type of silicone. So sometimes we do get separation, so I'll have to get in there and then rebond the surfaces together. So as far as this finger, everything looks good around the, around the edges. So we could see just nice like feathering, tapering from transitioning from the socket back into the body. Everything looks good there. I take a look around the nail, just making sure that the cuticle area is intact. I take a look at the nail bed. I'll take some separation so I can see here that he is getting some separation. So I'm going to have to rebond the underside of, of the nail bed to the finger to make sure that the nail doesn't start to pull out more around the edges. Um, internally within the sockets, you know, I'll, 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 I'll turn the, the socket inside out. So it's uh, silicone does have some cling to it. So sometimes it is a little difficult. Um, I can use alcohol at times to make sure that everything is good. Um, but I'll take a look deep into the socket, make sure that we're good. Looks like he may have like a little bit of separation taking place there. So I will touch that up. And everything else, everything else looks good. So I'll go ahead and spend some time uh, working on this. And uh, I'm saying about 15, 20 minutes, we should be good. And, and his finger will be good and good working operations that'll fit and function as intended. Thank you.